So I'm recording this video on a Tuesday evening, just after most of the main E3 conferences have gone on. I mean, I missed the latter half of Square Enix. Um, but I just thought I'd take this opportunity, mainly because this is probably the only chance I'm going to get to do a video this week. And I just wanted to say that, well, to, to answer a question, and that is, who won E3? Now, I know that E3 has just started, but I'm so confident that I know the answer. I'm telling you now, the winner of E3, drum roll please, is you and me and everybody else that loves gaming. And granted, that sounds like a bit of a cop-out answer, but it's true. And looking on Twitter, it kind of sums up really. There are so many people on Twitter and social media that are kind of slagging off games that they're not interested in, saying, oh, it's boring, I don't want to know about this, I don't want to hear about that, I just want to see the games I want. Shut up. The great thing about gaming is that, well, or anything, there is something for everybody. Granted, as a species, we are kind of ten, have these tendencies towards this tribe mentality, no matter whether it's sport, what sport teams we like, what music we like, what TV shows we like, always this kind of, my thing that I like is better than your thing you like. And granted, some of us really find that difficult to, to kind of get around that. But for most of you, get over it. There will always be things that you like that others don't and things that other people like that you don't. Just deal with it. If you haven't got anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. And I think if we all took that to heart, social media and the gaming community in general will be a lot more enjoyable place. It's been a great E3 so far. There have been some absolutely amazing announcements. Who knew that we would see a date for The Last Guardian? Uh, a Final Fantasy VII Remake, a new Star Fox, a Shenmue 3 Kickstarter of all things. We would have never have imagined that these things would have happened. But if you're going to be negative about these things, then these wonderful surprises will not only be cheapened and made sour, one day they may not be there. So think before you type something nasty on the keyboards. Just, just think. And even if you don't like a game, I don't like Call of Duty, but it, there are plenty of people that do, and fair play to them. I'm not the person that's going to slack them off, but what can I say? It's simple. Be nice to people, and other people will be nice to you. We all did that. Not only would the internet be a greater place, not only would the gaming community be a better place, but everything would be just amazing. Thank you very much for watching this video. Now, I'm not going to be doing too many videos over the next couple of weeks because I'm getting married next week, and believe it or not, I have more important things to do than, than play and talk about video games, which I find, even I find hard to believe. Thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe to the channel, and I will be releasing as many videos as I can. Please enjoy them, and until next time, happy gaming.